Hi, I'm Tracy, VE3TWM. Thank you for tuning in to Outdoors on the Air. Hey, it's time for the 2024 Winter Field Day event. And I am here with my friend Tom, Victor Alpha 3, Whiskey Bravo Alpha. We're set up, we're going to be running his ICOM 7100 from the park shelter behind me. We're going to set up my 50 foot DX wire mast. And uh, as you can see, my gosh, uh, in this strangest winter of all, we're finally getting snow. So stick around. The antenna we'll be using today is Tom's Homebrew ZS6 BKW. Tom, this is um, 40 through 10? It's 40 through 6. 40 through 6. 40 through 6. I've never used uh, one of these antennas before. A really nice feature of them as compared to a G5 RV is that they don't require a tuner on the bands that they cover, whereas the G5 RV really does require that. So I'm looking forward to giving this one a try. Tom has mentioned that I, you haven't used it yet, have you? I haven't. I've used it many times. Oh, you have? Camping, yeah. Okay, so you have. Used it camping. Mm -hmm. And it works great. And you can even do 80 meters with tuner. Fantastic. So it um, covers pretty good stretch of the bands. And I think it's it, it's pretty much efficient. And it's, a, it's, it, it's great. Like, you know, for what it is, I think there is no better antenna out there, like more, more versatile. All right. Now, uh, so what is the actual length of the, the radiators? It's, it's, I, I made it so long, I mean, like two years ago, I have the dimensions in the car, in the, in the box. Mm -hmm. uh, but they're like about, uh, they're shorter than, the, than 15 meters each. So I think they're like... 12 or 13 meters each arm mm -hmm. and the cable the window line is 12 meters long okay and that's pretty much and i i sort of tuned it for inverted v yep so it pretty much covers a digital section on each band that it covers so if, if you want to go to the to the ssb section you need to use tuner or i would have to you know tune the antenna make it slightly longer but uh, I did it with the idea that, you know, I'm going to use FDA and this kind of stuff. But like I said, it's even, even, um, even that with this SSB section, it's going to be like, um, SWR will be about two, maybe two and something. So it's, it's not bad. You can, you can tune it to what you want. So you have essentially two options, either to trim the antenna or, or to use a tuner to, to make it perfect for your radio. Okay, good stuff. Do you need a choke? At the end yes, of the you ladder definitely line. need a choke for this, and, and I have a cable with like a ferrite. So, uh, but if you depending on the choke you use, you may actually kill the six meter band. So you have to be careful with this and not overdo it. Like at home, I actually put uh, one to one balloon instead of choke. So everything and it's I think the core is uh, 43. So I've noticed it's like fantastic product, commercial product. It's fantastic, but it took away six meter band. Yeah. Versus when I put, you know, my crappy, um, crappy choke, uh, I had six meter band. So you, you have to be careful what you're doing and not overdo that thing, and because you may sort of impede the, the bands you want to you want to explore. Good stuff. Okay, thanks for the background information, Tom. Let's get this thing deployed. Okay, I'm going to try to keep wet snow off the camera here is the zs6 bkw now erected apex at approximately the 40 feet position coming down to my pvc pole mount and here's the operating position we're just going to get it set up now inside this unassuming box is tom's ICOM IC7100 Go Kit. Now, a lot of guys have gone crazy with their Go Kits, putting them in big, massive boxes that make them really difficult to work with and to lug to sites. Tom's, as you can see, is a pretty slim one. I'm going to do a video in the future profiling what he's done inside, but let's just uh, 
for now, give you the idea that what he's got in there is the 7100. There's a tuner in there. Uh, and uh, we are also going to be using this battery right here. Now, Tom uses uh, a, a, this is a cooler bag to store his battery. And in here, he's got, uh, what is it? Oh, this is, a, this is an SLA. So this is a 35 amp hour. SLA battery that we're going to be using to power today's event. We've got the ZS6BKW hooked up to the analyzer. Haven't gone on the air yet, but uh, let's just take a look and see what we're getting. And it's looking pretty good. We've got dips. Uh, that's just actually, I'm going to zoom in on 20 meters. See what we got. Whoops. Can you tell I'm still learning to use this thing? There we go. Run it across and okay. So here's here's the curve on 20. Uh, we've got less than two to one without a tuner across 20 meters. Let's just uh, zoom out a bit. Let's see if I'm getting the hang of this yet. All right, I want to go take a look. See what we get on 40, Tom. All right. So there's, it's there. we're in the 40 meter band, and let's just look here, whoops. So 40, uh, it looks like it's below 2 to 1 for most of the band, maybe just leaving, uh, leaving it uh, a little bit uh, high on the high end of the band. So most of the band without a tuner, that, that's pretty great. All right, let's... Go and see what we got further on up. Ten meters. Try ten? Yeah. Okay, so up on ten. So ten. Ten a little high. Uh, 1.8 to 6 is the low point at 28,760. But it's below 2 to 1. Let's just take a look here. What have we got? So uh, 28,365. Uh, to 28.745. So you could conceivably use it without a tuner on 10 mm -hmm. at, uh, uh, at these uh, frequencies. So pretty much do digital and single sideband. Yeah, okay. Good stuff. All right, now I guess we're going to put this thing on the air. All in all, it's taken Tom and I about an hour to set up. Uh, to get the antenna set up, get the station set up. The se station set up here with the ICOM 7100 was an absolute breeze. Didn't take more than a minute or two. I've got my iPad running hammers and the winter field day template. Uh, now it's time to get on the air and, and I'm, I, I want to set up uh, a station and just call CQ and see what kind of activity we get back. CQ Winter Field Day, CQ Winter Field Day, CQ Winter Field Day, Victor Echo 3, Tango, Whiskey Mike. November 1, Quebec, Charlie. November 1, Quebec, Charlie. Please copy one Oscar Golden Horseshoe. Copy one Oscar Golden Horseshoe. Please copy four Oscar November Hotels. You got to well, thank you very much for the four Oscar November Hotel, and thanks for the comment. Really appreciate it. Have a great uh, event. Enjoy the day, 7-3. Kilo 9, Alpha, Bravo, Romeo. Kilo 9, Alpha, Bravo, Romeo. One sec, please. Uh, Bravo, Romeo. Just a little bit cold fingers here. Uh, please copy, one Oscar, Golden Horseshoe. Thank you very much for everything, including the one Mike Wisconsin. Hope you have a great weekend and enjoy the activity. 7-3. 7-3, good luck to you. Kilo Charlie 1, Foxtrot, Oscar Zulu. Kilo Charlie 1, Foxtrot, Oscar Zulu. Did I copy your call correct, sir? Roger, Roger, you did. Okay, one Oscar, Golf Hotel. What is your section, your section again? Section is Golf Hotel, Golf Hotel, QSL. Golf Hotel, 
Gulf Hotel, Roger. Please copy one Oscar. That's one Oscar, New Hampshire, November Hotel. Copy the one Oscar from New Hampshire. Nice to make a contact with somebody from New Hampshire today. Thanks so much. 7-3 and good luck. 73, good luck to you and uh, thank you for uh, the VE station. You're my first as well. Kilo Oscar for Juliet Bravo Delta. Did I copy that correctly? USL, that's correct. Uh, I'm a one hotel in Virginia, Victor Alpha. Okay, copy your one hotel in Virginia. Please copy my one Oscar Golf Hotel. Roger, Roger. Can you tell me what Golf Hotel is? Absolutely. It's called, it's known as the Golden Horseshoe. It's in the Toronto area, and it wraps around Lake Ontario, QSL. QSL, thanks for the info. I've, I've had a couple there, and I didn't know where it was. All good. Not sure why they named it that, because it does confuse people. But I hope you enjoy the rest of the activity. 73, and hope you have a good day. Kilo Alpha 8 Delta. Kilo Alpha 8 Delta, please copy one Oscar Golf Hotel. Copy to India from Kentucky. Thank you very much. 7 3 and good luck. 7 3 and good luck to you. Station, call, station beginning with November. Come again, please. November 0, Mike Delta Charlie. November 0, Mike Delta Charlie. Please, oh, sorry, one sec here. Cold fingers. November 0, Mike Delta Charlie. Please copy. One Oscar Golden Horseshoe. 2SL, one Oscar Golden Horseshoe. Please copy, one hotel. Mike November, Minnesota. Mike November, Minnesota. Whiskey 5, Whiskey. Whiskey 5, Whiskey. Please copy, one Oscar Golf Hotel. I copy that. We are 3 India, North Texas. Over. Copy the 3 India in North Texas. Thank you for the contact. 7-3 and good luck. Hey, there's a QRP station. Whiskey 4. You actually got a pretty good signal. Whiskey 4, but could you come back with the remainder of your call sign? Whiskey 4, Charlie Echo Mike. Whiskey 4, Charlie Echo Mike. Did I copy that correct? Okay, please copy. One Oscar Golf Hotel. Copy the two Oscar in Sierra Charlie. Thanks so much for the QRP contact and good luck. Good luck to you, 7-3. Kilo 5, Victor, Victor. Kilo 5, Victor, Victor, booming in. Please copy one Oscar, Golf Hotel. Roger, and it's Victor Echo 3, Tango Whiskey Mike. Roger? Roger, Roger. Copy one Mike, Lima Alpha. Copy the one Mike in Lima Alpha. Hey, nice to make a contact with Louisiana. Thanks so much. 7-3 and good luck. 7-3. Victor X3, Kilo, Mike, Quebec. Victor Echo 3, Kilo, Mike, Quebec. Always nice to make a contact with one of my fellow Ontarians. Please copy one Oscar, Golf Hotel. Yeah, Victor Echo 3, Whiskey Tango, Mike. Uh, good morning, Tracy. It's Mike here in Burlington. Thank you for the one Oscar uh, Golf Hotel. Please copy one hotel, Golf Hotel. Got the one hotel, Golf Hotel. Just make sure you got my call sign right. I don't think you read it back to me, correct? Uh, Victor Echo 3, Tango Whiskey Mike, QSL. Yeah, sorry about that. Can't read my writing. Victor Echo 3, Tango Whiskey Mike. And I get this crazy, correct? QSL, QSL. Thanks for the contact. Kilogram Charlie 5, Yankee Foxtrot Japan. Kilogram Charlie 5, Yankee Foxtrot Kilo Charlie 5, Yankee Fox Japan. Nice signal. Uh, one Oscar Golf Hotel, QSL. Yeah, QSL, one hotel, Victor Alpha, one hotel, Victor Alpha, QRB. 
Copy the one hotel in Victor Alpha. Thanks so much for the contact. 7-3, have a wonderful weekend. Whiskey Bravo 5, Echo Sierra. Whiskey Bravo 5, Echo Sierra. Please copy one Oscar Golf Hotel. Uh, sorry, was that one India? Whiskey for Romeo Alpha Tango, please copy one Oscar Golf Hotel. Roger, Roger, please copy two Oscar Victor Alpha. Copy two Oscar Victor Alpha, thank you for the contact, 7-3 and good luck. 7-3, thank you for the contact. It's doing pretty good, isn't it, Tom? Not too sad. Well, we're going to pull the plug. We've been at this, uh, what, Tom? A little more than an hour or something? Yeah. So that, okay. Uh, 54 contacts made on 20 meters with the ZS6 BKW. It was rocking. Uh, now, Tom, the tuner was, was the tuner, the tuner was not in line, correct? No, the tuner was in line. It was but, in line. Uh, it wasn't working hard. It's like, I, okay. I heard it only did like, and that was it. It wasn't like working hard to, Right. To get us uh, yeah. to frequencies. So, yeah. and, and that's the tuner that's built into the 7100. No, the 7100 does not have a tuner. If you take a oh, look, there is a tuner that. on top of that. It's a third party. It's the LDG or something. Okay, yep. It's yeah, another it's tuner that sits on top of the ring. All right, fantastic. But what can we say? The, the antenna worked extremely well. Uh, right. you, you saw how the install went. Uh, I was able to take a frequency on 20 and just call CQ and in about an hour's worth of time uh, managed uh, 54 contacts so and, and all over uh, North America uh, Alabama um, I don't think we hit it or Arizona we got somebody in Arizona uh, got uh, Kentucky. Connecticut all the way down to yeah Gulf Coast lots of Florida stations uh, Massachusetts, uh, up into New England, uh, even out to Nova Scotia. Yeah, so great coverage with this antenna. Uh, very, very impressed, Tom. Yeah, Excellent job. It is a good antenna. Like it's, uh, that's what we were talking about, and I think it's, it's a pretty good all-over antenna. And like, if you even don't have a tuner, it will work for you know, important bonds. Yeah. We didn't have 15 meters. There is like no dip on this antenna for 15 meters. So the only thing, this is like the only thing that bothers me. It would be nice to have 15 meters. Because I think like today this band is on fire. Yeah, probably. But, you know, it is what it is. Well, it is, as it worked, even though 20 was busy, we were able to carve out a spot for ourselves uh -huh. and make a lot of contacts Fantastic. in a short period of time. That's pretty much one contact per minute. Yeah. Oh, good stuff. Okay, well that's it for this time. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate your support. Hey, there's a super tips button. If, if you wouldn't mind uh, pressing that and sending me a few dollars for a coffee or a tea or something, I'd sure appreciate it. But anyway, appreciate your support as always. Until next time, now it's your turn. Get out of the shack, get outdoors, and get on the air. 7-3 from Tracy, VE3TWM.